been on the road for about a year now. I've met some wonderful people. I've also mastered the art of making porridge in a motel room kettle. Yeah, I tell you, there's nothing more inspiring than looking across a car park to a busy freeway whilst scraping glutinous oats off the bottom of a calcified electrical appliance from the mid-1970s. It goes well with a side of suicide contemplation, I've found. I do like a roadside motel, though particularly when traveling in remote areas. Airbnbs in the middle of nowhere can be a little bit fucking terrifying, can't they? Uh, I thought you said that this was an adjoining dwelling. Well, the beds are adjoining. <laughs> True story. <laughs> Regional South Australia is a chilling part of the country. <laughs> I love being on the road, I'm a big fan of it, I have a lot of fun and uh, there's not many downsides, but there is one thing about constantly travelling and staying in different places, one thing that I'm sick of. Do you know what I'm fucking sick of, Brunswick Hat? What are you sick of? Thank you very much. <laughs> Call and response. I am fucking sick of writing my experience. <laughs> Why can't I just stay somewhere or eat something or travel somewhere without immediately having to fill out some customer survey to reassure the business I've just interacted with like I'm trying to dig a codependent lover out of a post-coital shame spiral? <laughs> did, you, did you have a nice time? How was it for you? What can we do better? What's wrong with us? What's wrong with us? Provide an avenue for complaint. Like, if I'm unhappy, I'll be the first to write a strongly worded email or perhaps slip a crude drawing into a suggestion box. <laughs> but if you don't hear from me, just assume everything was fine, our transaction is complete, Fucking back yourself! <laughs> it's everywhere now. There's touch screens now at the airports. They feature like a, a spectrum of emojis. So you press the face that's closest to your own face, having just experienced whatever your face has just experienced. They have them outside the toilets at international airports. Touch screens! Outside the toilets! <laughs> Now, just for the moment, let's ignore the fact that that touchscreen is a giant petri dish for literally thousands of stool samples. <laughs> I still resent having to rate my experience of going to the fucking toilet. Oh, gosh, OK, I've got to do this script. No, guys, I'll catch up. Yeah, no, I'll get the next flight. I just have to do the script. <laughs> OK, uh, here we go. OK, golly gosh. Um, all right, uh, which face? most accurately depicts my emotional state, having just taken a shit at the airport. Um, oh, this is tough. I can't choose between tragically desperate or shamefully humiliated. Oh, but right, I'll just go with, I didn't wash my hands! I can't tell if you guys are on board with this or not. Just by round of applause, who here is sick of doing surveys? Who's with me? Stay on your toes.